most muscular and tough, and then going out again, those are the kind of exercises to me that were like, uh, you could not replace them with any machine. This was it. One of the main things, of course, in order to create size and to create muscle growth, which will sometimes the body will hit the wall. And what that basically means is that the body is saying, look, I know all your tricks. I know you're gonna start first with bench press. And then I know you're gonna walk over to the chin-up bar and do chin-ups. And then I know you're coming back to the bench press, and then you go to the chin-up bar and come back to the bench press. I know that routine. I know exactly everything you do, and I am prepared for that. So you have to go and use the shocking principle. The body and if this chest knows that I'm going to start with 135 and then I go to 225 and do 275, I'm going to go and start now with 315. And I'm going to do 20 reps with 315. And then I'm going to go and have the guys pull off plates. And then I have 225 left. And then I'm going to do another 10 reps. And then I'm going to take the, have them take off another 45 pound plate and then I have 135 left and then I'm gonna go to do another 10 reps. Or maybe if I can, do 15 or 20 reps. And let's see if the pectoral muscle is used to that. And then all of a sudden you will find that your pectoral muscle is shaking after that. And you don't know what to do because it's cramping and it is being tortured. And it is in pain because you have now shocked the muscle.